the gladiators. We're ready for the men who are bracing themselves to run the gauntlet. Nikolai, welcome. Hello, Zoe. How are you? I'm very well. So discus throwing is your thing? Sure is. That's why they call me the discus man. The discus man? The discus man. Oh, you've got some fans here. Yeah, there's a couple there. A couple. What are you training for? I'm training for the Olympics, hopefully this year or the 2012 or next year's World Championships. Oh, well, good luck with that. Thank and you. And who are you trying to impress most um, by being on Gladiators? I'm trying to impress my mum sitting over there in the crowd. Oh, Give mom. her a wave. There she is. Why are you trying to impress her so much? Oh, because she does everything for me, so I'm going to show her what a little boy can do now. Oh, that's so sweet. Thank you. Good luck. Thanks. Lincoln, you're a high-performance driver trainer. That's right, Tom. So what does that involve? It involves uh, going around racetracks teaching people how to uh, use their vehicles to their best of their ability and stay safe. Um, but I tell you, driving at a racetrack at over 200 kilometres an hour with people that you've just met is a lot more scary than meeting these guys. All right, so it sounds like you're ready to put the pedal to the metal. I am ready to go. All right, now you also do some magic tricks. I do. My wife Melissa and I have two lovely boys, Cooper and Parker, and uh, they love the magic tricks and also their friends at school, so we just keep them entertained. Awesome. Big shout out to the kids because yeah. now I have got five fearsome gladiators ready to take you on. No Are you ready I'm for ready Hunter, Tank, Cooter, Outlaw and Thunder? Challenger! Are you ready? Gladiators, are you ready? Three, two, one. Speed Freak Lincoln hits the gas and gets away from Hunter. Tag is doing well to block him in the second zone. But now Kuda, he's up high. Kuda blocks. He surges on. He's into the thunder side. Has he got anything left? What a collision with the Mad Mountain. Lincoln gets up. He's fighting so hard. He's trying to spin thunder around. Thunder holds him down. And it looks like he can't get through. Oh, thunder sends Lincoln flying after the whistle. That's not on. What's gotten into the big man tonight? The referee, Bill Harrigan, will have something to say. Challenger, walk away. Thunder. You know once the whistle goes, you don't get involved. Yellow card. All I do is stop competitors getting through. There you go, Lincoln. Yeah. Thunder's off to a yellow card. You slipped straight past Hunter at the top and then you sneaked into Cooter. He had you wrapped on the side a bit though. Now Cooter had me there for a little while. I had to rethink the strategy through. I thought I'd still get through Thunder. No, it's hard, mate. It is very hard. It is tough, but uh, oh well. I gave him the best. You sure did. Well done, Lincoln. Go and get behind him, everybody. No points for Lincoln. The Gladiators regroup and let's see if Nikolai can do any better as he gets ready to take on the gauntlet. Challenger, are you ready? Gladiators, are you ready? Three, two, one. Discus throw, Nikolai flies past Hunter like a human projectile. He's in a tense military zone, side to side. Mum looks on anxiously. He throws him back into another zone. He's got to release him. Tank's got to move back into his own area. Nikolai has lost momentum. Can he regain his composure here? Tank is holding firm. Let him up. Let him up. Let him up. Grab hold of him. He's pinned by the crushing force of Tank. And Tank again has another go. The whistle goes. The Gladiators are very happy with that effort. In particular, Tank. Mum's not too impressed. And the referee is going to have something to say. I want to go to the replay and have a look at that. The tackling of Tank. You can see there that the challenger was in his safety zone. And there Tank has put him back from the safety zone into another Gladiators zone. Tank, therefore, is disqualified. The challenge is awarded the 10 points. Oh, 10 points! Not bad. There
Was very it really strong. tough to get by them? It looked like it was very difficult. It was enjoyable. It was enjoyable. Very enjoyable More experience. More enjoyable for you because you've got the points now. Oh, I'd love to do it again. <laughs> oh, I'm not too sure if I'd want to do it again. Neither male challenger got through the gauntlet, but Nikolai hits the lead with 10 penalty points. One suspension bridge and four demolition balls spun by gladiators who want nothing more than to hit you with their best shot. Reckon you've got what it takes to run across it? Welcome to the world of hit and run. Yeah, and the first to get a taste for it is our challenger, Kim. From the likes of Nitro, Viper, Olympia and Angel. To score points, the challenger has to cross the bridge while avoiding the gladiator's demolition balls. Each successful crossing equals two points. Challenger, are you ready? Gladiators, are you ready? Three, two, one. Kim had a sensational running gauntlet. How will she go and hit and run? The tactics right here. She's just fainting, waiting for the opportunity. She gets through for two points. She waited well, timed it perfectly. She looks up and just evades the ball. And again, she's got four points. Three balls have gone across. She can see an opening. She waits again, times it to perfection. And she's got six. She takes off, looks ahead. Oh, she is taken out in convincing fashion. She put on the accelerator and then it was splat. The Gladiators got her on that fourth crossing. There was the hit. And let's hear what Kim's got to say for herself. Oh, well, I could see that coming. I just got a little bit too eager towards the end and paid for it, but happy with that. Hopefully I do better in the next one. And now Louise is about to play target in dodgeball taken to the extreme. Challenger, are you ready? Gladiators, are you ready? Three, two, one. Louise just motors ahead. Oh, she didn't see it coming. She didn't see it coming. Taken by a sneaky one from Angel. The female gladiators in top form tonight. Let's check out Louise's short-lived run. You stop, you drop. She definitely had her eye on the ball, but it was the wrong one, Louise. Louise, I don't think you saw that one coming. I just don't, didn't try hard enough, I think. I, I should have stayed my ground and then tried to keep moving, I don't know. You had your eyes on the other side, didn't you? Yeah, I did, but I think that was weak on my part. I really do. I'm very disappointed with that. Never mind, you've got other opportunities. Angel, nice hit. Thank you. Well, individually, we're pretty brilliant, but as a team, we're undefeated. The Gladiators certainly undefeated on a hit and run. Kim managed to squeeze out six points. Louise wasn't as fortunate. At the halfway stage, Kim sitting on 16. Louise yet to score. After the break, Kim meets her destiny on sumo ball. And will some challenges never learn? Any day, any time, if that's what he's got, bring it to me because I can handle it. 